the Chennai Super Kings. The defending champions, remember, they beat the Gujarat Titans uh, in the IPL final earlier this year. Uh, how did they fare at the auction? Let's bring up uh, what they did at the auction. Uh, now, these are the players they picked. Um, lots of Kiwi flair there, but Rachin Rachin Ravindra, Daniel Mitchell, Mustafa Fizur Rahman towards the end of um, the auction. There was Aravali Avanish as well, Samir Rizvi we've spoken about, and Charlul Thakur, uh, more so for, for, for Chepok Choi. Yeah, absolutely. And I think, I think that's what I'm saying. Mustafizur also bowled wonderfully in conditions like that. So Mustafizur gives them a backup for Thikshana. Uh, sorry, for Patirana. Patirana. They give yeah. them a backup for Patirana. He's a very, very clever bowler. Yeah. And he'll do very well under those conditions. Shardul is a known commodity. They've just got him back. They've just strengthened that side of theirs. Because that allows them to play one more uh, batter out there. Now they can go and take a chance with an international batter. Because Shardul can actually play and replace Patirana if necessary, yeah. as Harsha was yeah. talking about. And you have an interesting situation where who is the spin hitter now? Yeah. And the designated spin hitter could be Daryl Mitchell who they've paid for because they, now they can afford not to play Patirana if necessary. But that designated spin hitter could also be Samir Rizvi, which is why they picked him. So they'll go to camp, uh, allow Dhoni to scope it, look at his casting direction again and decide where which piece to put where. I think it's not just casting director, I think he, he likes playing Tetris. Okay, this piece goes here, fits in here, suddenly it goes down, put another piece here, okay, will it go down? Is there anything MS Dhoni can't do? Ruturaj Gaikwad is touted as uh, the, the next leader for CSK, but a look at the squad. Uh, uh, Harsha, you, you reckon this team is ready for IPL 2025 and beyond? Do they have enough players that they can look at from a retention point of view as well? You know, once, it's something I do every time. The moment a team is picked, I say, okay, who's the first 11? Who's the backups? That's the best way to look at any team. Create your first 11. I know we now create 12, not a fan of that. But create your first 12 and say, okay, for key players, is there a backup? Let's look at Chennai and see what they've got because, as Joy was saying, you always make double changes. They needed a replacement for Ambati Raidu. That replacement for Ambati Raidu is, is, is Mitchell. Now, the moment you do that, you must have someone else uh, at the other end. And that is what Shardul Thakur has done. So that is the mix that they have got now. And Ruturaj, Conway, Rahane, Dubey is their designated spin hitter. Daryl Mitchell or, or Moin Ali, they'll go that way. I think it's a pretty good side. Ravindra Jadeja. Uh, Thakur, Chahar, pa Chahar, Patirana, Tikshana. It's, it's, I, I think it's a good side because Tikshana bowls a new ball along with Chahar. Shartul bowls in the middle. Patirana comes back to bowl at the end, maybe with Chahar, maybe with slight weakness in the uh, death bowling yeah. over there still. Still dependent on Patirana. And with Patirana, if he plays, you cannot do a switch. Uh, you cannot have your impact sub with, with Patirana. So they've got to be very careful of the overseas players they pick. Death is still a factor unless Chahar can become that bowler. They spent 14 CR for Daryl Mitchell. How does one explain that? They spent 18 crores on Ben Stokes and didn't pick him. So with them, that is the one franchise where you can say for certain that the auction price does not guarantee a place in the starting 11. Mm. So Mitchell's not guaranteed a place in the starting 11. They might still go Moin Ali. And so, also, Rachin Ravindra, who is the flavour of the World Cup, uh, is he going to be an understudy for one IPL? Mm. Or is he, oh. is he a straight backup for Devon Conway? I think yeah, right now he's backup because who yeah. is there for? Because I, I, don't see them in the, I don't see him in the first four. Because I, I definitely see Moin playing, I definitely see Conway playing, unless he plays instead of Moin. Yeah. If he plays instead of Moin, then he'll probably bat at three because I don't think he's the greatest batter at five or six. Yeah. I think if you play Rachin Ravinder, you'll bat him at three. Yeah. Then the batting order changes a bit. Uh, but they, they could do that. If yeah. they play Rachin Ravinder, they could play him in place of Moin Ali as well. That's an option for them. But I see two players really hit, trying to push their way into this side. One, of course, is Samir Rizvi. And the other is Hunger Gekar. I think they think that he's... You know, much more developed player than he was at one year with. The yeah, I think if 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 they had thought Hunger Cake was ready, they may not have gone to Shardul, because they already have Tushar sure. Deshpande who's done well for them. Mukesh Chaudhary, when he's in form, swings the ball. He is good. Deepak Char, if he's fit, he is good. So it'll be hard for Hunger Cake to break into this side. Mm. They've got fizz on tracks that grip. He might be the option to Patirana. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So it they've is. got that covered, but still between Conway, Moin, Ravindra, and Mitchell. They can only pick two. Because I think Tikshana still walks into the side. Yeah. Right. So they picked six players today at the at the mini auction. Uh, very quickly, gentlemen. Out of five, how many for uh, 
if you were to rate CSK's performance at the auction, looking at the six players they picked, uh, how many would you rate them out of five? Mm. I would go three and a half. That okay. they've done a reasonably decent job. They overpaid a bit for Mitchell, but again, we are saying they go. They're still going home with money. So yeah. they've got whoever they wanted to. They're still going home with money. Mm. I'd say three and a half. It's it's a decent. They've strengthened some parts. They've added a couple of intriguing new pieces to the mix in somebody like a Salim Rizvi, uh, Samir Rizvi. But they, I don't think it's not a slam dunk as a you know. It's not fantastic. Three point five for me. For you? About there. J just just about there. If Dhoni was not captain of the side, every time I look at CSK, I say, if Dhoni was not captain of the side, but I still like the side very much, I'm liking the side because of the Dhoni approach, which is we will now go hard. Can they continue playing like they did last year? Yeah. Scoring more runs than anyone else in the, uh, or as much as anyone else in the power play in the middle overs. And I think they've got the team to do that with the arrival of both Mitchell and Ravindra. So if that is the philosophy they've picked by their philosophy, I'm going about three and a half, four.